how do you think your policy of partnership and fair dealing has, en has enhanced or detracted from your investment returns? The consolidation taking place in insurance has been taking place for some time. There have been some big mergers over the years. Uh, it should. There are developments in insurance. We mentioned the the uh, supercat bonds, which are not bonds at all, but um, uh, that has an effect. Uh, but I would say that the that there's no merger that has taken place that I regard as uh, being detrimental either to our uh, Geico business uh, or to uh, our reinsurance business. Uh, uh, that has not been a factor, and I think if, uh, if there were some more mergers, it would not be a factor. I, I, I see no way that, that any entities being put together would, would change the competitive situation uh, in respect to GEICO. GEICO, operating just as it does independently, uh, is as competitive as can be, and it would not benefit by being part of any other organization and uh, our reinsurance business is much more opportunistic uh, and uh, it's not consolidation there it's 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 just lack of fear generally by competitors who um, can price uh, particularly cat business at a rate that could be totally inadequate as I use an illustration in the report but nevertheless it could appear to be profitable for a long time and uh, uh, there's probably more of that going on now, and there'll probably be a lot more going on uh, uh, in, in that arena. We, we have some sensational insurance businesses, though. I'm, I have to tell you that, that uh, uh, you, 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 I don't think you really have to worry too much about how we do uh, in insurance in the future. We had, we had a number of GEICO people that, here today. I hope you got a chance to meet them. GEICO, uh, uh, and you saw Lorimer Davidson, I really was hoping he could be here, but Davey is 95 years old. I went to visit him a few months ago. It just isn't easy for him to get around, but uh, he, uh, he built a sensational company and it stumbled once. Jack Byrne got it back on track and, and, and Tony Isley's got it going down the track at about 100 miles an hour and it's getting faster all the time. So we've, we've got a great business there. Charlie? Nothing to add. <laughs>